What's up, everybody? How y'all feeling tonight? I love that there's a lot of hotties in here tonight. Yeah! Tonight, we are celebrating 40 years of the VMAs. I am your host, Megan Thee Stallion. Houston, Texas, shout out to Simone Biles. She let me borrow this, I just added a few things. Also, though, I wanna give a shout out to my hotties. And my Hades, cause I know y'all watching too. Ah. As you can see, I am repping team VMA. And tonight, VMA stands for the Voluptuous Megan Awards. deserve a gold medal for being a bad bitch. Now to present our first award. He's the public enemy icon who introduced us to some of the baddest women that we know on reality TV. And now he's teaching us water polo. And she is a two-time Olympian. Give it up for my girl, Jordan Childs and Flavor Flav. Yo, what's up, VMAs? Hey, yo, check this out. This is such an honor to be standing right next to Jordan Childs. And you know what? I just want to turn this into a little Olympic moment for a second, if y'all don't mind. Hey, yo, Jordan. Yes? I know they tried to take your medal away from you, you know what I'm saying? But you know what? I got you something that they can't take away from you. to say here. Thank you so much. Oh. He's stylish, stylish. Yeah, as y'all know, I am an official sponsor for the United States Olympic water polo team. So that's why I wanted to turn this into an Olympic moment, Jordan, all right? Thank you so much. It's hey, and guess what else, too? Yes. I got your prize money, too. <laughs> I got that for you. I got that for you. Thank yeah. you. Yeah, Thank I got, you. I, I got your prize money for Thank you. Thank you. I just wanted to surprise you with that. I didn't want to say nothing to you backstage, but Jordan, you did your thing. Thank Congratulations. you. Congratulations. You deserve it. Thank you. It. And the VMA goes to... Taylor Swift. Swifties in the building! Yeah, boy! You have been so nice to me. Guys, I wanted to say, you know, waking up this morning in New York on September 11th, I've just been thinking about what happened 23 years ago, everyone who lost a loved one and everyone that we lost. And that is the most important thing about today and everything that happens tonight falls behind that. Um, but it is so amazing to have the opportunity to thank and honor the people who worked so hard with me on this video. 
There is a very clear reason why Post Malone is everyone in music's favorite person to collaborate with. And it is because you are so ridiculously talented, you are so versatile, and you're the most down-to-earth person. Honestly, so unfailingly polite. It has taken me forever to get him to stop calling me ma'am. Um, so do you want to say something, Austin? Uh, yeah. Yes, ma'am, absolutely. Um, Taylor is... Uh, I, I, <laughs> a lot, uh, absolute loss for words. Um, absolutely one of the most um, kind and talented people I've ever had the honor of knowing. And um, just, just the amount of, um, of work and care and love that she puts into everything she does from the music video to every, I watched her um, tied up to the, like, operating table thing in the music video. Yeah. And she was just directing the music video from there, and it was pretty <laughs> badass. Um, but um, I just wanted to say thank you so very much um, for listening, and thank you so very much, Taylor. And I love you very much, and have a great day. Next artist is a trailblazing global superstar. Her stadium tour was the highest grossing ever for a Latin woman, and her latest album made history as the first Spanish number one, all Spanish, by a female artist. And after an unforgettable performance at last year's VMAs, she's back again to do it all over. Give it up for Carol G.
Please welcome Tinashe. For the past 40 years, the MTV VMAs have been the platform to catapult new artists to a global audience. And the VMA for Best New Artist recognizes the breakout talents that are on the way to that superstar status. This year's winner will be joining a very exclusive list, and you get to help decide. So vote now! The power was in your hands to name this year's Best New Artist, and you narrowed it down to three. Tonight, Chapel Road, Gracie Abrams, and Tyla battle it out to claim the ultimate title. Scan this QR code to vote on WhatsApp or head to vote.mtv.com. VMA flashback. And we got a madman. This guy is rock and roll. He should be getting the award. Don't know me. Oh my God! I tried to hold it down for Britney. All right. Next. This next presenter is an icon, and her new album, Infinite Icon, is out right now. Give it up for my girl, Paris Hilton.
Sean Mendez debuting his new song, Nobody Knows, in three, two, one. They pass it from one Sean to another, I see. Shout out, how's everybody feeling tonight? Shout out Eminem, my boy Posty, Shabuzi in the house, a lot of people here. So look, the VMAs have always been devoted to elevating young and emerging artists, and tonight our extended play stage presented by Doritos. We love Doritos. We love Doritos. We'll feature two of the breakout artists of the year who are both former MTV Push artists. First up, a man who won over fans by covering Michael Jackson and Shania. He sold for four VMAs this year. Give it up for Teddy Swim.
Coming up, Sabrina Carpenter gives us a taste of that Mi Espresso. Let's make a start on the... to vote on WhatsApp or head to vote.mtv.com. Keep watching to see who takes home the gold for Best New Artist, presented by DraftKings. I won my Moon Man Award in 1984 at the first ever VMAs, and it was a great year. It was a great year for women, and I am happy to say women have continued to dominate the landscape. Okay. And two, 2024 is no exception, and this next performer definitely knows how to have some fun, right? She's a, she's a wonderful songwriter. She writes very catchy songs, landing massive back-to-back -back hits. And you know what? Her album this week goes to number one. So... Get ready to hear the entire place say, motherfucker, are we allowed? Okay. Here is Sabrina Carpenter!
She's one of my great friends. She's a Brazilian baddie. Yeah. From Rio to the VMAs, she's making moves, breaking records, and making all of us want to dance. Here with Fat Joe, DJ Khaled, and Tiago Pesekha, Anita. Anita! To see more behind the scenes from the Doritos Extended Play stage, check out POV VMA on MTV's YouTube. Coming up, Camila Cabello makes a smashing return to the VMAs. Our hot girl host, Megan Thee Stallion, brings the house down with a
a fire performance, and later all eyes are on her. Chapel Roan makes her highly anticipated VMA debut. Tonight, we honor one of the best-selling artists of all time. The only female singers have had five number one turn out a look and turn heads. She's a mother, and she is mother. She is Katy Perry, and her iconic video Vanguard performance is coming up. The MTV Video Music Awards are brought to Music's biggest superstars are battling it out for the most coveted award of the night. Who will take home the VMA for Video of the Year? Will Ariana Grande get your love? For we can't be friends, wait for your love. Or will Billie Eilish eat the competition for lunch? Will Doja Cat paint the town red? That get to my head. Or will Eminem make the competition disappear with Houdini? Will Taylor Swift and Post Malone's legacy last longer than a fortnight? Or will SZA put the competition to bed with Snoop? Find out who takes home video of the year when the MTV Video Music Awards continue. VMA flashback. Welcome to the VMA! Are y'all ready to get this show started? Y'all know MTV have been giving the girls their flowers all night. Make some noise for the ladies. Sabrina Carpenter, you just killed it. Thanks for teaching me that it's espresso and not expresso. Now you gotta make a song about scrimps. The Video Vanguard is the most coveted award at the VMAs, and the last six have been winning! Right now, we're adding Katy Perry to that iconic list. <laughs> to honor her, please welcome the star of the upcoming movie, The Cut, Orlando. Hey, guys. You fell in love with her as Katy Perry. I fell in love with her as Katherine Hudson. You know her as a global superstar who brings love, light, and her unique sense of humor to every song she writes and music video she creates. I know her as a mother, as a partner, who brings that same love and joy to our family. In moments when we've most needed it, her music and the remarkable world she creates have brought a sense of joy and laughter, inspiring generations of people from all over the world she loves with her whole heart, and it's kind of irresistible. I see it reflected everywhere, in our home, in her love for her work, but especially in her love for her fans. Congratulations on this honor, baby. I'm so proud of you. One, four, three. Ladies and gentlemen, your 2024 MTV Video Vanguard, Katherine Hudson. Katy Perry! Give it up for our newest video, Vanguard. 
Katherine Hudson, no. Katy Perry. You know how this is really heavy. Who's looking after our daughter? Hey, I thought you were. Oh, oh my gosh! Thank you, I did that all on my first day of my period, too. Can you believe it? Thank you so much to MTV for believing in my weirdness from day one and for helping artists extend their worlds beyond a song. There are so many things that have to align to have a long and successful career as an artist. There are no decade-long accidents. So I would like to acknowledge a few people. My team, who have been with me for over 20 years, direct management, and my label, Capitol Records. Trust me, it takes a village of strong people, a lot of healthy discourse, and a lot of group chats. My parents and my family, the deepest roots I know, we don't always agree, but what a lesson that those disagreements can still be full of love. Thank you to MySpace, Warp Tour, and all the bygone places where I found a voice, identity, and a community so early on. Thank you to the friends that were there when my Jetta was repossessed. My Katie Cats, who stood by me for a lifetime, and the LGBTQ community who I recognize I would not be here without, and who show me that you can be both kind and cunt. Thank you to Orlando for keeping me grounded, celebrated, and doing the dishes. And lastly, for my daisy, the only flowers I'll ever need. I'm excited when I look around music today and I see all the amazing young artists who are operating with confidence, agency, vulnerability, and authenticity. I've heard a lot of do this, don't say that, wear less, wear more now. Hey, don't cut your hair. One of the biggest reasons I'm standing here right now is I learned how to block out all the noise that every single artist in this industry has to constantly fight against, especially women. I just want to say with my whole heart, do whatever it takes to stay true to yourself and true to your art. Turn off social media, safeguard your mental health, pause, touch grass. And do what you were born to do, just like I was born to do this. 143 comes out September 20th. I love you! Yes, yes, yes.